this is the energy vibration um reading for um the Aquarian Sun Moon Horizon sign for the first week of January. Happy New Year to each and every person. Happy New Year. Okay, the week begins um from um the week begins from uh 31st of uh, December until the 6th of January. Um it is a week of the balance. Um it is a week of balance which is an earth energy and the zodiac energy is hurt so it's earth all around so let's see what is going to come out for you guys I've changed up the way I've done the readings it's going to be in a different format different things is going to be happening so welcome welcome and thank you for returning please like share these video thumbs up thumbs up cross watch is very important to cross watch so you know what's gonna happen for the rest of the people um, please remember to also listen to your Sun moon horizon sign that is the other planets that is around you and that is in um, uh, in your birth chart when you were born okay so you have the the Sun sign and the moon sign and the rising sign okay so let's see let's see thank you so much for supporting my channel and thank you for returning so we're going to be looking at the Aquar um, Aquarian Sun Moon and Rising sign for the first week. Week beginning the thirty first of December until the sixth of January, and we have the energy of the Tower. Then we have the energy of the Page of Pentacles. Okay. Then we have the energy from the Lovers. Okay, so obviously the tower is a fire sign, page of pentacles is a heart sign. You have the energy of the lover, central of your reading is a five of one. So some of you are having some conflicting situations in relationship, um, some conflicting situation that is happening in relationships. So, um, it's all about the lovers. Some of you could be receiving some messages. So, then we have the energy of the seven of pentacles it could be having some conflicts with your work projects or wheel of fortune things are going to be starting to happen in for you guys wow and we have the energy of the four of swords you need to take some rest okay you need to take some rest so um this is beautiful um so we have the whole week and what is transpiring is that uh, some of you need to find strength in this week to deal with certain situations okay so that's what in the middle of your reading okay so we're going to be um moving this a little bit further out to look so it is a week of an earth week it's overall an earth week and as we're looking at your week because overall and Earth Week, and we're looking at what is going to be transpiring um, for you guys. Um, the central is conflict, and you finding inner strength to deal with a situation in this week. There's going to be some conflicts. Now, those conflicts could be coming in all different forms because there are thousands of you out there. But whatever the conflicts is, you have to find inner strength to deal with this and get through it. Okay, the conflicts could be coming um, from the work floor. Okay, so uh, when I say from the work floor, the conflicts could be coming in from the work floor. Um, it could have to do with um, basically um, things that is transpiring. Um, uh, from off the work floor okay so you you need to be very very kind to yourself now what I'm looking at is that there's relationship there it's going to be um, people who are connected with relationship the number five energy is coming up so there's a lot of conflicts okay so um, people who are in relationship you have to find inner strength some of you are going to need to take rest from a relationship okay whatever is transpiring some of you need to take a rest from a relationship it is here um, it is as if this relationship is taking all your energies and you need to just step back and take some rest now someone the page of Pentacles is here and the end and, and, and it's like it's breaking down so some of you could be ripped off by someone 
and this is coming to an end so you need to take a, a good look at that because someone some of you out there could be ripped off by someone and um, what is happening is that you are taking a step back and looking at what exactly is going on okay so um, whatever the situation is you need to check the lovers comes up twice so a lot of you are going to be dealing um, with some some relationship situations okay um, obviously some relationship situation now I'm seeing some conflicts um, that is happening but some of you who have been you know starting something it has been a push and go as uh, whether it's in relationship whatever it is it, it's going to be getting better in this week I'm seeing a lot of you having conflicts with relationship people who are in the, um, um, you know business partner who are having a connection with business partner and that sort of a thing I'm, I'm really seeing it's going to be a week where a lot of stuff is about to transpire you're going to be seeing the truth of something what is so good is that the energy of the tower is here you're beginning the week like you're removing certain things in your life okay you're removing certain things in your life and I see that some of you realize that someone was taking you for a ride when it comes to do with money and you're ending that and it's a relationship it's a partner in your relationship and you're ending that um, I'm seeing uh, okay what's coming up is that some people with projects your project is going to be taken off I'm seeing you're tired you're tired I'm seeing you're tired here we go here we go um, the ten of cups the two of cups and the five of Pentacles so there is a message for someone out here okay so um, there's a family situation there's two people who really cares about each other the energy of the five of Pentacles and this is what I'm saying to a lot of you there is a lot of transition that is um, coming up for you guys a lot of transition that is coming up for you guys I'm seeing a lot of tiredness um, a lot of tiredness a lot of things that is transpiring in your life so um, some of you who were really going through um, four of swords is here so number four is definitely number four is definitely going to affect you guys whatever is happening number four is is um, the energy okay the lies and deceitful is over with a project okay so if you were working with someone on a project or in a project and you felt the seedfulness and deceptionness this is going to be over the devil is this is going to be over okay so I'm loving this and you're wondering why you're not seeing the cards okay um, some of you are, you know I've gone through a very tiresome period and this is um, coming up very tiresome period this is coming up what is transpiring is this this energy is about to release okay so you're going to be coming out on top this energy is about to release what I'm seeing here is that the page of Pentacles some of you your kids there could be something your kids could not be feeling well um, some of you have some regrets spending a whole lot of money um, at Christmas there's a lot of regrets that is happening some of you you're dealing with a situation with your kid your kid isn't feeling well and this is affecting you okay you have some regrets um, some of you about spending too much money in um, in um, the December period love some of you are going to be reconnecting um, with um, either someone who is very rich or someone who brings stability to your life some of you are going to be reconnecting with your mom if your mom is a Taurus or a Virgo or a Capricorn you're going to be reconnecting with your mom some of you could be um, wanted to reconnect with this um, lady okay it could be a grandmother that you're going to be reconnecting with okay now whatever the conflicts is and the conflicts that is happening there is that some of you are going to be moving away from this conflict some of you could be over overcoming this conflicts what is going on okay some of you could be moving overcoming this conflicts what is going on and leaving it behind 
some of you who are working on projects and people were trying to block your projects um, this is going to be coming to an end now okay the lies and deception and um, this is all going to be coming to an end so this is positive wheel of fortune is here and it's affecting some of you in this um, week and the wheel of fortune is bringing you some positive news so this is a lucky break for some of you out there which is very very positive the wheel of fortune there is news that is coming in to bring you some luck and this is going to be good now if you notice you have you begin with the four you begin the week with the four of swords and you're coming back with the energy of the four of swords and you have the four of swords the energy of the devil okay so this is when you become very stressed out it's as if a negative energy is taking a negative energy um, is feeding off of you and you need to always rest 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 so go and connect with Oracle thing there he will clear the energies in your house it can be that you picked it up from someone that sort of a thing is happening so um, align yourself with this so, now for some of you um, a family situation where um, I'm seeing some of you really connected really happy but yet still um, the devil is as if um, someone is um, blocking um, either your financial flow or want to uh, invade the, the energies in your family situation okay because um, here is the energy of the five of Pentacles. you feel you know this is what it should looks like this is not and the energy of the devil is over it so someone is trying to get involved with some of you who are in relationship they're using negative energies um, to do that or they're wishing you um, okay so this is why you are having this hardship not to worry not to worry because this is going to be coming back because you're going to be receiving news about this so this is going to be coming back and you're going to be receiving news about this so it's gonna be um, and this was a message for someone I don't know um, people who have been going through um, negative um, situation in their life and that sort of a thing um, this is what had come up for you okay so be aware that you know people can try everything but if you don't let them let them have their own ways you can break the cycle yourself okay you can break the cycle yourself and it is good to take an energy um, clearing from Oracle touch because that will be good or get a past life reading from um, uh, Felicia at um, sacred soul okay so this would bring you in action now I'm working with the animal spirit guides for the Aquarians animal spirit guides for the Aquarians in this week and we have two cards here because we're changing up the readings we have two cards here and I want you guys to choose one of the cards okay remember the one that you choose this is one and this is two okay so remember the one that you choose one or two okay now we're going to be looking at one card one is focus you need to be very very focused in this week whatever is happening balance yourself and be very focused in this week whatever is transpiring you need to be focused you need to ask for grounding and ask to um, bring balance in yourself because you're dealing with inner strength and conflict so you need to, to um, there is some conflicting situation that is going on around you and you need to um, bring um, that strength and stability and focus so if you choose card one um, it's uh, is the card of focus now if you choose card two you have the energy of the cow it's nurturing abundancy and axing and receiving nurturing abundancy axing and you will be receiving okay so this is powerful so ladies and gentlemen I really like your reading for the first week I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back and I'm saying namaste until next time